Coach, if you don't mind starting out with an opening statement, just how you thought the season went and just kind of reflect on that a little bit. Yeah, definitely um, couldn't be more proud of this team. Uh, it's a really special group of young ladies, um, people accepting of their role and just buying in and giving everything they have. Um, proud of our improvement um, throughout the year and uh, the growth that everybody had. Um, and then this game, you know, this game hurts. Definitely it's fourth time we played them. Uh, they went 11 for 22 from the three-point line, and they've got a powerful post inside, and so you kind of got to pick your poison. And, um, you know, hats up to T Tampa. They're a very good team, um, but couldn't be more proud of these young ladies on each side of me and everybody that was in that locker room. Mary, you had such a good half. What was it like coming off the bench and just immediately contributing to the team? Um, well, I think I'm just such a competitor. I just go in there and want to do anything I can to help my team win. Um, you know, whether I'm playing five minutes, 20 minutes, 40, I'm just going to go in there and try and do anything I can to help us win. Madison, being the focal point of the offense, what was it like for you just to be out there, you know, you're out there getting every loose ball, driving the paint, taking charges. What's it like for you to be the big hustle player and be there just for every step of the way? Yeah, um, I realized that with the you know, responsibility of trying to score, I realize that sometimes, you know, when I'm in the game, I may not always get those shots or those looks, and I, you know, take, do some introspection and kind of like realize, okay, well, how can I impact if it's not scoring? So if that's on defense, getting steals, getting rebounds, defensive rebounds, um, if that's getting assists, any way possible, how can I impact the other four players or the other 12 players on the um, bench? How can I impact? So. And then for Mary or Madison, what do you guys look back uh, when you reflect on this season? Like, you know, you guys had such a good year um, going against Tampa four times. You know, that's always difficult playing conference opponent, first round of the playoffs. What do you guys see out of this season? Yeah, I'm really proud of this team. I'm really proud of every time that, you know, we faced um, Tampa that we've always had a positive outlook. We've always learned from our mistakes. And you can see with the last, the last um, game that we played on Thursday last week and then now, um, very big difference, and I'm proud of those girls. And I firmly believe that we never lose, we just run out of time. So if, you know, obviously I look back and if there's some things I could change, obviously, but I'm super proud of the effort that we um, gave out tonight. Yeah, and on that, um, reflecting on the season, honestly, I just had a lot of fun. Like, comparing this season to last, or uh, this past season to last year, um, it's just so much fun to win and be able to be part of a team that competes and gets after it every day, but still walks off the floor and is best friends. And like something, even with this weekend, I was just like thinking last night, I was like, I just enjoy being around these people so much. And I've just had so much fun, like growing and becoming better players, people, and they just, the people around me make me better. And we've just had an unbelievably fun and awesome season. Coach, maybe a quick uh, update from you. We have such a young ball club. Maybe talk about this season and how much growth from your freshmen and sophomores and how this year and this postseason run can help you for the future. Absolutely. I think we have eight or nine underclassmen, um, and we have a really good core coming back. We have three seniors graduating that made such an impact on this program in on the court and all, absolutely off the court. Um, but we have a really good group of core players coming back, and they're going to be hungry. Uh, we just talked about that in that locker room, how bad this this stings, but the experience of being here and understanding what it's all about and making this the standard of our program now and coming back here next year, um, maybe not, I don't know that we were nervous, but just kind of not knowing what to expect. Now we know what to expect. And I know without a doubt that this returning group is going to get after it this off season. And I can't wait to see, uh, they're all going to come back better at something because that's just who they are. That's the kind of team we have. So can't wait to see how they uh, come back and, and come back and we'll be here next year, wherever the region host is, maybe it's us. You're ready. We'll be there. We'll be there. Okay. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.